Sally, I hear something. Stop. Stop. Oh! Oh! Welcome back to my channel, Love Lauren here, and thank you so much for clicking on this video. In today's video, I'm gonna be watching a movie that I have been dying to watch for a while now, and that is the original Texas Chainsaw Massacre from 1974. I think I said in a previous video, in the Exorcist video, I believe it was, I mentioned how I've seen the Texas Chainsaw Massacre, but I've only seen the one from 2003 with Jessica Biel, and I've never seen the original. So I'm super excited to watch this movie. And after we watch this movie, I'm gonna watch the new trailer for the newest Texas Chainsaw Massacre that I that is gonna be coming out on Netflix. I purposefully have been avoiding it just for this video so I can watch the original and then the trailer. So I hope you guys are ready. I hope you guys are excited for this because I'm super excited to watch this movie. So grab your chicky nuggies, grab your chalky milk, and let's jump in. All right, guys, let's do this. I'm ready. A Vortex Henkel Hooper production. So I am imagining this movie is going to have like the similar plot as the one the I saw from 2003. See is an account of the tragedy which befell a group of five youths. In particular, Sally Hardesty and her invalid brother, Franklin. For them, an idyllic summer afternoon drive became a nightmare. The events of that day were to lead to the discovery of one of the most bizarre crimes in the annals of American history, the Texas Chainsaw Massacre. <laughs> oh, gosh. Oh. Ooh. Ugh. Oh my gosh, the sounds. Deputies report that in some instances only parts of a corpse had been removed. The head, or in some cases, the extremities removed, the remainder of the corpse left intact. Evidence indicates the robberies of oil storage units continue to burn out of control at the huge Texaco refinery near the Texas Louisiana border. Three so, were those bodies from the crypts they said then? And injuring a dozen more. Firefighting units from three Texas cities continue to battle. Huh. See, you know, I just feel like this movie, it's older. They have like a way of making things scary then. You know what I mean? It's just more to your imagination. You don't really know what you're looking at here. It kind of looks like blood. It could be like organs. Like you don't know what you're looking at. A young man reportedly angered by a local television blackout of a sports event jumped from the 10th story window of his apartment. Jeez, you hear that news announcer? Oh, evil armadillo, no. Mm. He poor little poopy. That's kind of a gnarly van. That's an old Ford van. I haven't seen one of those in ages. Doing his business. All right, I feel like I should look away. <laughs> Just Jerry, it just means Saturn's a bad influence. It's just particularly a bad influence now. Well, you can definitely it's tell it's from the 70s. Hey man, you believe all that stuff your old lady's hawking me? I don't know. My granddaddy's buried here. Can we find out if anything happened to him? What's your granddaddy's name? Honey, that big heavy fella's a stand with that flashlight in his hand. That's a sheriff. You go tell him your granddaddy's buried in there. Uh, What's this guy's deal? Hear about? They'll tell about. I, I see things. <laughs> you see, they say it's, it's just an old man talking. You laugh at an old man. <laughs> There's them that laughs and knows better. <laughs> oh, what's that? What smell? 
wherever they are right now. What is that, that drunk guy was kind of just helping us forge shadow there a little. You look at all the moo moos. Moo. 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 I mean, the little moo moos moo are so cute. Hitchhiker. Should we pick him up? Oh yeah, man. Pick him up. He'll asphyxiate out there. What does he look like? Oh, the sun. Like no! Nowadays you'd never pick someone up on the side of the road. That is sus. Unless you want to end up like like this in one of these situations. I'm so sus of hitchhikers. I've seen way too many scary movies to pick up hitchhikers. And I've read way too many scary stories to pick up hitchhikers. <laughs> What is he wearing around his neck? My brother worked there. My my grandfather too. <laughs> my family's always been in me. My whole family attractions. And they scrape all the flesh away from the bone. This guy is, is way too into this right now. This guy is super sus. Why would you let him take that from you? A knife. What are you doing? Hey man, put that knife up. <laughs> Come on. like why would you why and he's got a camera yo look at that camera that is like an antique oh yo look at that camera that's wild hey, you, you can take me to my house I, I live right off this road well I, I don't know man we're in pretty much of a hurry how close it's real close They're all like, uh, I think we'll pass. Well, I mean, he, he was, I can't tell if he was trying to be nice or not. He seems like he was trying to be nice. He just different. <laughs> he just built different. A few moments later. This guy is not all there, clearly. This is exactly why you don't pick up hitchhikers. That could have been way worse, but still, ugh, who knows how dirty that thing was that he got cut with and ugh. They were very 70s, very, very, very 70s outfits. What's there? Oh, that's blood, all right. And that guy cut the hell out of himself. Why wouldn't the blood be on there? Like you watched him cut himself with it. Yeah, I probably should have washed that off. I feel like driving around with blood on the side of a van, probably not great. Oh no, I got a bad feeling. I've got a feeling. 
I feel like the guy marked them or something. Like he marked them. Wow, look at that old place. Whoa. That's the destination? Wow, look at how old that place is. Ooh, what is that? Are those a bunch of daddy long legs or something? What are, what was that? Why did they just, they just left him outside? This poor guy, Jesus. And that's such an old wheelchair too. Look, that is not made for like terrain. Such an old chair. One eternity later. Uh, yikes. What's going on there? Some voodoo magic? Come Sally? On. Some witchcraft, maybe? Sally? Some markings? Oh, those are... Sally? Yikes. Oh. I can leave him my guitar, you know, give him a couple bucks. We gotta come back by here anyway. I can pick up my guitar and give him a couple more dollars and bring him back some gas. They don't want your guitar. They're not gonna want to sell us some gas. Let's just go back now. Oh, I don't know about this, fam. All right, so they're walking up. To property that they that's not even theirs they're trespassing right now they're looking for gas hey, for the come van here. come here look at this ooh look at all the cars in there wow Pretty nice looking house. Uh, is that a tooth? Got something for you. Why? How does that not? Does that doesn't freak them out? The fact that they just found a tooth Hello? just like hanging around. Hello. Look, this guy—they're just asking for trouble. Who opens up people's doors like that and just like let yourself into their house? Sir, you are trespassing. Hello? You step foot in there. Hello? You're definitely trespassing. even looks sus man what do you mean what is hanging from the ceiling in that room yeah hello there's like bones all there's like a freaking jaw right there for crying out loud 
a foot? Like, what? Yeah, that's, that's, that's a pretty big red flag, you know? I'd, I'd pro say it's probably time to go. I'd say you'd, uh, you've overstayed your welcome. You were welcome there in the first place. You kind of let yourself in. This is what happens when you let yourself in. Just leave. Go home. Yep, 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 yep. You better. Oh, God. That is a big dude, fam. got bad, didn't it? You really are mad, huh? Oh, I, I don't blame you. Shouldn't have been trespassing. Kirk! Never gonna find a man. At least he knocked. Don't go in, man. Why is that people, why is that like their first thing to do? Like they knock and nobody answers. So their first, like their first inclination is, is to go to open the door and like let themselves in. Like what? You're just gonna let yourself in. Why are you even knocking? Well, that's his jacket, huh? That's their friend's sure. jacket. Okay, you guys. Come on out. Oh, sh Oh, there she is. Hello? So he has this kind of different demeanor, Leatherface. He has kind of a different demeanor and like behavior than the one in the other movie I saw. Like, I don't remember the other face making this much noise. Like, he's making noises that I don't recall. Is he distraught right now? He seems kind of distraught. Did you see how he was licking his lips? Oh. Well, that's three down. There's only two left. Sally, we ought to go to that gas station and get help. I'm not leaving you without Jerry. Jerry! Jerry! They'll probably be back in a minute or so. Yeah, this was like pre-cell phones, so... This was way before cell phones, so they just had to like kind of sit around and wait. Franklin, let me see the flashlight. I'm gonna go look for him. You don't have to go. That's oh, jeez. I don't think that's a good idea, Sally. I don't think y'all. Definitely not a good idea. Just give me the flashlight. No, no, I'm, I'm gonna honk the horn, and we're gonna wait a minute, and then if they don't come, well, we'll go. All right. Yep. That sounds like a good plan. <laughs> that sounds like a good plan. Sally, they took the keys. We don't have any keys. They took the keys. Stop it! Stop it! Oh, 
took the keys? Oh no. Jesus. They're just calling the killer to themselves. Like, they are not incognito at all right now. Sally, I hear something. Stop. Stop. chainsaw behind you. Bed. She's still running pretty good for jumping out the second story there. Look at how fast he is! Oh my gosh, this guy is like a freaking track champion! With the chainsaw, just hauling oh, ass. Come on, keep running! Don't give up! Oh, right into that tree! Wow. That was terrible. Oh, you're screwed. This guy's in on it. This guy's in on it. He's way too calm right now. Sheriff's deputies have found a reported dozen coffins robbed of all or part of their contents. 
What is all that? This feels super sus. What are you doing? Uh, you, you got no need to worry. No! No, no, you just cooperate, young lady, and we'll have no trouble. Not out of this. What do you want? No, no, no. There's no need to do that. Nobody's going to hurt you. No! <laughs> What the f I knew this guy was in on it. Ugh. Ugh, that dirty drag. Ugh. These people are sick. So where is he taking her now? Back to the freaking back to Leatherface? There's that guy. Just slam the door on him. So they've officially caught all of them. Look what your brother did to the door. So Leatherface was is his brother, and he's scared. Wow, Leatherface is scared of him. So he's uh, he's like the guy in charge, basically. It's like their dad or their uncle. Why is he squealing? They treat each other you know you can see how they treat each other you can only imagine how they treat others like like this even worse Bring the dead body downstairs. Oh my god. Yo, you guys, this is disturbing. Like, this is. Oh my god, they're gonna sit him at the table. He's dead, and god knows how long he's been dead for, and they're just gonna sit him at the table like that. guy was dead well this was a very unexpected uh, twist
Oh, that is disgusting. Grandpa do it? The dead guy? <laughs> Yo, these people are off their rocker. <laughs> Run, if you can. Oh my God. She just got bashed over the head. I could have swore I saw like a hole in her head. They're just playing, it's like, they're just playing with her at this point. Like they're, they're not even, they know that they can catch her. Like they just get com they they get comedy out of this. They think this is funny. Like, damn, I should never stop. Oh! Oh! Damn! Nice throw, man! Nice throw! Yeah, that was slowing down. Oh, this is f chaos. My gosh, was that the end? Was that the end? Yo! You guys, that movie was wild! I was expecting, okay, so the plot, so a lot of the plot was similar there. Same kind as like that, that one from, well, the 2003 one is based off of this one. All of them are based off of this one. So you can see where those other ones got like a majority of the framework. They they, they pretty much just kind of like built upon it and changed it in some ways. Wow, the original, it was really good. For like the 70s, you know, that was, I thought they did a really, really good job on that. They did, they did a good job, I was scared. I think the biggest jump scare for me was when she was pushing that guy in the wheelchair and then Leatherface just comes out of nowhere, just like boom, right there and just like, just starts chainsawing that guy in the chair and I was like, oh man, that was a shocker. I was not expecting that at all. So now that we've seen the original Texas Chainsaw Massacre, finally have seen it, gotten it out of the way. I'm so happy I finally seen that movie. That is long overdue. With this new um, Texas Chainsaw Massacre trailer that just came out. So that's what we're gonna watch next, just to just to see how different it is compared to the original. So I'm actually really excited have, now that I have the original Texas Chainsaw fresh in my mind. I'm actually really excited to watch this trailer. So let's let's watch the trailer right now. Let, let's let's do this. Let's see how different it looks. Oh, starts us off action packed right off the get go.
Oh, this is like a really different vibe, isn't it? So Harlow is a ghost town. We have a vision for this place. All it needs is young blood. I don't want to live here. This is a chance for people to start fresh somewhere. This is like a completely different plot almost. I mean, it is. Hey Teenagers in a town and... You see this. It's like modern day Texas Chainsaw. What are you doing in our house? You really shouldn't be here. More gore. This is hard, Esty. I'm afraid your old friend's back. Oh, and that's supposed to be the girl from the first one from the original Texas Chainsaw. Oh, no way! Just to see him again. Thought it's supposed to be her. major inspiration it looks like from the original texas chainsaw massacre which we just watched the only the, the girl that survived the only survivor it looks like they basically bring her character back um it almost feels like it almost feels like a halloween kind of situation you know with like like a jamie lee curtis kind of thing like oh, i'm gonna see him again like uh, or even like a scream thing. They just did that recently with scream, you know, where they're like bringing back original characters or like that. So that's really interesting. Uh, that's really interesting. I'm kind of noticing a pattern with some of these new new horror remakes. Let me know what you guys thought of my reaction to the OG Texas Chainsaw Massacre as well as the trailer in the comment section down below. If you like this video, please give me a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe. I appreciate your support so much. Every little bit counts. Thank you so much for watching this video. Until next time. Dee dee.